Hi, Jen Dayton, Collection Development Coordinator here at Darien Library. I've got some picks that are coming up for your book groups or just for you selfishly. We're going to start with the debut novel, Self Portrait with Boy by Rachel Lyon. This is coming out on February 6th. It's the story of a young woman in 1990s Brooklyn. She's squatting in a warehouse. She's a starving artist and she's in the middle of a project she's calling Self Portrait. And each day she takes a self portrait. Self-portrait number 400 turns out to be her masterpiece. As she is leaping in front of a window on a beautiful, clear summer's day, as she is leaping up, her neighbor's child is falling down to his death, and this becomes her masterpiece. It's the story of being young, being an artist. It's absolutely terrific debut fiction. I still think about Lou and the choices that she made. I think it would be terrific for book groups. So, Self-Portrait with Boy, February 6th, Rachel Lyon, terrific. Anna Quinlan's back. She's gonna have another one here with the alternate side. This one is coming out in March, so you don't have too long to wait. Um, Nora Nolan is an average, everyday housewife living in New York, and what she thinks is the perfect quiet pocket until something happens and her neighborhood is blown apart. Classic Anna Quinlan. Who doesn't love Anna Quinlan? Um, again, this one's coming out towards the end of March, March 20th. This has to be one of my favorite books of the year. I cannot wait for you all to get your hands on it. Verena by Charles Frazier. For book groups especially, the tale of one woman's life is seen through the back and forth of time, beautifully written. Um, Verena was basically the second child bride wife of Jefferson Davis, the first and only Confederate president of the United States. Um, really, truly, this is, this is one of my favorite books of the year. It's a masterpiece. I know a lot of you didn't like Cold Mountain. I didn't like it either. This is a totally different book and it's really worth your time. Verena by Charles Frazier. This one is coming out in April also. Paula McLean's back. She's back with Ernest Hemingway, only this time it's the love story of Martha Gellhorn and Ernest Hemingway told throughout the Spanish Civil War and World War II backdrop. I started it this weekend. It's showing great promise. Nobody can tell a story like Paula McLean. She's just terrific, and I know that you book group people love her out there. So, Love and Ruin coming out in, um, I want to say, oh, May. You're going to have to wait for May for this one but it's gonna be worth your wait, promise. Hey, if nothing else, we can go into that mythical beach bag that we keep all dreaming of. And finally, the last book that I've selected is from the incomparable Ursula Guin, one of the last interviews she gave on the art of writing. Um, we lost a real treasure when Ursula died. We could go now. Um, this is an interview. It's going to be in book form. It's coming out in July. They might push it up, I'm not sure, but it's about the craft of writing and how, what inspiration she took from other writers and I probably think that she was pretty self-deprecating about the inspiration she was for all of us. Anyway, um, Conversations on Writing, Ursula Le Guin, July. That's what I've got for you for this month. Have a great one.